Welcome to our series about 3Shape Communicate. While watching this video, you will learn how to navigate the application user interface. The 3Shape Communicate app can be installed on mobile devices, functioning on Android or iOS operating systems. It enables not only the viewing of cases, but also the active communication between a dentist and a lab, writing comments, using simple tools like arrows, or drawing over a screenshot. Both dentists and labs sign in to the same application. Start by logging into the application by using your 3Shape Communicate login and password. Once you have logged in, the list of patients with cases and a preview of each case will be visible. After logging in, orders will be updated automatically and the time of the last update can be found in the lower left corner. Just scroll through the case list to find a desired case or type in the name of the patient in the search window. All cases visible on the list have their status marked by a suitable icon. The information button, once clicked, will lead you to the order list quick guide where the icons are explained. It is also here where you can log out from the application. You can also click the download orders button to decide which time period you wish to download cases from. When set, just click back to move back to the guide and then to orders. To open the chosen order, just click on it. The tab with orders will open, 2D pictures with scans and 3D previews of teeth. Or face scans will load shortly. Pull the patient name a little bit down to see all the case information. It is also here where you can continue previous conversations or start a new conversation by writing a comment. Now you can freely change between 3D and 2D. To be able to fully utilize the communication possibilities given by the application, switch to 2D to see the scans, shade measurement, attached annotations and comments, and also HD photos sent with the scans. Click on each attachment to see it in full screen mode. Use the 3D view to observe scans from different angles and different detail levels. Click on a scan to use the full screen mode and extra functions added to the application. While in 3D view, use one finger to rotate a scan in 3D or double tap it to reset it to the initial position. Use two fingers together to move a scan in 2D or move two fingers in opposite directions to rotate it. Spread the fingers on the screen to zoom in the scan. You can change the background to black for better contrast. Or use sliders to change the visibility of the scans. Enable and disable visibility of certain scans and features like antagonist scan, design or pre-preparation if added to the case. Remove or add margin lines while examining it, if it was added for better communication. Change from color and monochrome for better contour visibility while examining the margin line. If you need to add a comment or ask a question in relation to scans and features, take a screenshot. This will move you to the edit screen. Click on the arrow button to enable arrow adding. Click the arrow plus button and move the arrow to point to a place that requires attention. Adding multiple arrows is possible and you can always remove an arrow that is active at any given moment. If it is necessary to draw something on the screenshot, use the paintbrush button. Choose color and use your fingers to draw. It is also possible to use the Apple Pen on an iPad and other pen types on Android. Drawings can be adjusted using the eraser and removed using the bin button.
Now, when your drawings and callouts are added, click the thumbs up button to save it and get the possibility to add a text comment and send it for consideration. When you press send, the screenshot will be added to the order and visible in the communication thread. Extra comments can also be added if necessary. You can have a preview of the application features before registering in Communicate. Just download the application and sign in with the Showcase login. No password is required. Thank you for watching.